All right, we're back over here. Hello there. Okay. You guys do know that there's white legs. Okay, yeah, you know. You guys know. Shot of sorrows in the back of the head. Welp. Accidentally the whole thing. Look at that. Perfectly good toasters. Oh my god. I don't want to press X. I want to press Z. Thank you. Look at this. Pre-war toaster. Beautiful. Hey. Stop shooting. Ain't nice. Oh, that guy's dead. Search. This. And watch this. Perform a ritual. We're in... Oh, right behind you. Hun, hun, right behind you. Shoot this bitch in the mouth. Or miss. Ah, oh, you're bald. Lol, dead. Dead horse's stalker armor. Take this. Look at this. Perform a ritual. Come back to me. Come back. Arise, chicken. Arise, chicken. He's not coming back. What the hell? Didn't want to take everything, but, uh, yeah, sure, why not? Wait, did I not apply this stuff? Oh, yeah. Duh. Yeah, they have a lot of crap around here for no reason. Let's see, you have tomahawks, dark detora. Yeah, whatever you said. Okay. Why can I not dishonor? The hell? No longer contains a soul that I just like, eat their soul or something? Apparently I disrespected the, the bad person. Wait, did my... How bad did my karma just go? Oh, I'm still a messiah, so, like, I give a fuck. Bottle caps. That's good stuff. Oh. See, they have a lot of random crap around here for no reason. Yeah, look at that. Bottle caps. Damn it. Didn't need it anyways. What can I make? Nothing. Nothing that I want. And John Graham, or Joshua Graham, is still not around here for some reason. Probably off doing the nasty, like an asshole. Alright. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. You didn't see me. didn't see me. What? Some of these people, what they say, I have no I fucking idea. I have no I fucking idea. Yeah. That's how you English properly. <coughs> see, look. Freaking, there's a pickaxe there, there's a microscope. Ammunition boxes. Oh shit. Three Mary's Cavern. I don't know why. 
but I feel like I must go in there. And so I... Oh, God! Yeah, everything collapsed. What the hell just happened? No idea what just happened, but, uh, okay. Just get out these, because I know there's going to be white legs in here. Bring it, bitch. Oh, shit. right motherfucker bring it on I got all your tomahawks anybody else want to mess got enough to go around I just took the scrap metal. Why? I'm not sure. I'm guessing I did have to go through three Mary's caverns, so worked out for the best. Wait, is there anything over here? Oh, there's a box with Insta Mash and Cram. Delicious. All right. Oh, there's brain parts. Bam! Shot him so hard his body froze. <laughs> Hurts, doesn't it? Shit. Shit. Boom! Skills with a tomahawk. Oh shit. Hi! I missed. Hi! Now she died. Alright, um, so anyways, what's over there? <gasps> Tripwire! Probably bear traps around. Grenade bouquet? Probably. Huh. 
I can oversee the entire camp. Hmm. Well, it kind of sucks that Joshua Graham isn't in our party anymore, because uh, I really like to see him, you know, pistol whip a bunch of bitches. Yeah. Probably should have brought more rounds with me, too. If I had more HP rounds, that would be great. Oh shit. Bitch got fucked. I guess they found their own way around. That guy just got thrown off the fucking thing into. Where'd he go? I guess he disappeared. Yeah! Get down, get down, get down, get down. Yo, dead. See, he had a he had a fire axe. No need to point the gun anymore. Okay, never mind. If you're gonna point that gun, you're gonna do it, and you're not gonna fucking take shit from anybody. gonna take the high road though I still don't know where Joshua Graham is oh that's not an enemy Maybe it's because of the collision mesh. Sneak attack critical. Did you just call me a devil? Hey. Oh shit. calling to be civilized about this and just shoot each other seriously it's just getting way out of hand falling rocks let me guess I'm gonna get I'm gonna get watch this oh no I guess I'm not gonna be thwarted and not able to go back hmm. that's a nice surprise for once Anti-venom. Somebody's dead over here. Yeah, they're definitely dead. And that's a dead horse. Oh, these guys are afraid. Do we have them captured or something? Is this just this guy just like spontaneously just caught on fire? What? Good. Nice. Just, that guy just punched him in the face. No fucking mercy. Damn. Oh shit. Damn it. My eye. Back off. Ah, oh, my eye. Got the extension cord right in the eye. You bastard. Call of Duty quick scopes. Hell yeah.
Anybody else want to mess, huh? They don't call me Leet Scopes Optics for nothing. Because that's my username on Xbox Live. Yeah. I got all the quick scopes in the house, homie G. Oh. Shoot him. Right in the back of the head. Do it. So this is where Joshua went, I guess. Um. Joshua. Can 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 you shoot him? Okay, that's a glitch. Oh shit! Oh my god! Shoot him! Oh my god! Great! Fucking chasm! Fucking glitches! Oh, I'm all the way back here. My game crashed. So, guess what? Apparently, Joshua was lost. I had to walk all the way back to find him. Unable to move because he was didn't want to swim. So he got all pissy and he's like, whatever. So This is taking too long. We can't let salt upon wounds escape. Yeah, because apparently... We're going to find a way around. God willing, we will finish this together. See, what happens is... Oh, magical companion ammo added. Yeah, no. Now I'm going to have to give... I'm going to have to give that back to him. You know, just... You know, screw it. Screw it. Wait, have I been, have I been using... Yeah, I had to use those scripts. Oh, my God. Yeah, at one point, he didn't want to... He didn't want to... Um, come around anymore. So I want to know what he did. He, I, I had to drag him through the water with my Groovatron, and he started floating on the water. He started walking on the water like Jesus. I'm not even kidding you. It, he hated water that much. And you're dead. And now it's just basically the same routine. So I will see you guys when I get to the next cutscene. Alright. Alright, we're back. We're right here and all this bullshit. Now we just gotta pass the stove. Wait. Ooh. Aw, oh, damn it. Once he was in the crate. Shoot him! Oh my fucking god. Joshua, really? <sighs> Dude, you really need to shoot this guy or else I'm gonna fucking shoot him for you. God damn it. Alright, everything should be good now. So here we are. Cutscene. He's supposed to shoot them. But I guess I'm gonna have to add the ammo to him. Okay. God damn it. Welcome back. So apparently, Joshua is stuck in like an infinite loop. He just he can't Welcome do anything. Back. Goodbye. God be with you. I, I tried to give him companion ammo and all that good stuff. Nothing happens. So. Oh, Jesus. I just got launched. Hello. Out man. Kuna man mad. He kill all white legs. You talk. You stop. <laughs> Let me talk to Joshua about this. Him hear you. You talk. Don't listen to this thing. His cries are those of a mad beast caught in a thicket. He gave no mercy to my family, and I will give none to his. 
Um, no objections. God. Yep. Yeah. That's cool. Wonderful. Let's try that again. Out mine. You're right, we're gonna kill you, but not like this. Defend you yourself. No ni kumpa me. De ya you. Ni kumpa. Oh crap. Yep. Yeah, he brought friends. Joshua, much help appreciated if you fought. Ow! Oh, I'm dead. Yep. Now my body's rolling around. Try this again. Now let's do this right. in the ass. Just throw a tomahawk at him. Hmm? Yeah? Let me give you a taste of this. Oh yeah, you don't like it in the legs, do you? Taste tomahawk. Tastes good, doesn't it? Tastes like chipotle pork. And you exploded. No surprise there. Take this and this. I'll take this. Oh yes, I'll take all that. What? What? I fought him fair and square. Oh my god, this is retarded. Jesus Christ. Out mine. Let's try this again. Nico On Joshua. Die where you stand. Shoot him right in the leg. Well, they didn't fail the quest for me, so, uh... Prepare to meet your mate. Hot cross buns! Hot cross buns! Hot cross buns! Ow. Oh crap. Head! 
Boom! Oh, daughter of Babylon. It's the same end he would have met if he had died on his knees. But I suppose this was for the sake of the dead horses and sorrows. Level up. Still, thanks to your help and the grace of God, the White Legs won't be troubling Zion anymore. Let's go find Daniel. Tomorrow we'll be here soon enough. And there is much to do. Yes, indeed. All right, now we gotta choose a, a we gotta choose a perk. Let's see, field medic, fortune finder, gunslinger, lead belly. <sighs> Poker face. Nah. If I had a sneering imperialist, um, one of my options to say to Joshua would have been, um, cap Mr. Gobbledygook. <laughs> that would have been funny, but very, very racist. Um, you know what? Wait, did, our, did we already do? We already did the Gene Splicer one? Oh, crap. What are we going to do now? Next level, we get one with Martyrs. Risk Taker. Don't need that. GRX. Face of Deception. Add Absorption. Lessons Learned. Nerves of Steel. Slayer. Solar plowed, why not? Solar plowed. Oh, there we go. And so it was that the conflict between the new Canaanites and the White Legs was finally resolved. The courier's involvement had tipped the scale, shifting the fragile balance of power. Despite their defeat at Three Marys and the death of their war chief, the White Legs were determined to pursue the other new Canaanites. But when they finally tracked down their prey in Colorado, they discovered the tables had been turned. The White Legs, who survived the new Canaanites' ambushes, were hunted down by dead horses before they could reach the safety of the Great Salt Lake. When word of the White Legs' diminished numbers reached the Hades tribe, war was declared. And by year's end, the White Legs had been wiped out. See? The Sorrows fought beside Joshua Graham and the dead horses eradicating the threat the White Legs posed to Zion. When the Courier and Joshua Graham felled salt upon wounds, their victory was celebrated with a great feast. Yeah. The Sorrow's transformation from a peaceful, timid tribe into a proud and warlike people broke Daniel's heart. He tried to take solace in the knowledge that they would remain in Zion, but it was a small comfort. The Sorrow's innocence was lost. Having helped eradicate the White Legs from Zion, the Dead Horses returned to Dead Horse Point in triumph. They remained neutral toward the Sorrow's, but as years went on, there were periods of competitive friction, even violence between the tribes. The new Canaanites, Daniel especially, intervened regularly as mediators but found it difficult to reconcile the tribe's conflicts. The defeat of the White Legs and Zion marked a turning point in the fortunes of the Happy Trails Caravan Company. Every two months, the caravan met with the new Canaanites in Zion Valley to trade. Happy Trails soon returned to prosperity. The vigilance of the sorrows and dead horses in defending southwestern Utah, initially startling to Happy Trails caravans, soon proved a blessing. The tribes united against the 80s, driving them back from Highway 50, and thus opening yet another trading route for Happy Trails caravans. Follows Chuck took the courier's words to heart and decided that he would behold the sights and sounds of distant lands with his own eyes and ears. 
After returning to Dead Horse Point, he quarreled with his family and other tribe members about his ambitions. One morning, they awoke to discover that Fallen's Chalk had set off alone, westward, into the wilderness. He was never seen again. Waking Cloud was distraught when she learned of her husband's death, but took comfort from her tribe and the compassion of the new Canaanites. She forgave Daniel for having concealed her husband's fate from her, and learned to accept his fate. When her grief faded, she took a husband from the Dead Horse tribe. At her bidding, he stayed close to home. Though the courier had stopped Joshua Graham from executing the salt upon wounds, the war chief still fell in battle. The White Legs defeated at Three Marys, Joshua led the sorrows and dead horses in tending to their comrades and burning the corpses of their foes. He continued to advocate militant opposition to the enemies of New Canaan and showed little quarter to those he fought. And yet he was changed. He no longer reveled in the brutality and cruelty for which he had been known in his former life. His inner demons, if not extinguished, were at the least appeased. For years after the defeat of the White Legs, Daniel did his best to minister to the Sorrow's spiritual needs. Try as he might, he could not hold back the tribe's increasing militancy and reverence of Joshua Graham. Demoralized, he returned to his family and Dead Horse Point. His failures haunted him for the rest of his days. And with that, the courier walked out of the history of the tribes of Zion and back to the gathering storm of the Mojave Wasteland. And yay. Yeah! And we get a canyon map. And I think it just gives us like a location of all the points we missed, which I don't think there are any. So hell yeah! And as you can see, all the same stuff. You know, Daniel's hat... Daniel's hat, Jock's headdress, a light shining in the darkness. And now we can return home. Uh, rad roaches. One of them has a gun. a machete gladius. That's kind of uh, disturbing. Yep. And we're back in the Mojave. And we're going to do some gambling. But first, we need to get settled in. Get on some appropriate clothing. We're still dressed like tribals. How are we going to get into a casino? We need to wear something sharp. Something nice. See you guys later.